Hey, we went all wolves here. It's Thursday morning. Early Thursday morning. Oh, check this out. I'll never get used to that. Anyways. Um, early Thursday morning. I uh, wasn't able to um, do it last night. So I'm doing it today. So today is actually the 8th. So happy 8th, everybody. Happy the day after th uh, Thanksgiving. Happy the day after New Comic Book Day. Uh, this is the train wreck, as you can tell. Um, I'm here to show you what I picked up yesterday. And I'm going to catalog them. And I'm going to bag and board them. And I hope I have enough, because this is all I have. <sighs> so it wasn't a big week. It was only this... Look at this. It was only this. So I probably got it. And I'm going to show you this one first. And I I picked it up. Look at this thing. Can I? Oh, I can. I can put it in my catalog. I think I can put it in my catalog, right? Yeah. So um, I, I, I've seen a couple of shows where people uh, op actually open this up and look at it. It looks awesome. You know, it's, it's from Alex Ross. And the inside is dumbed down. It's uh, it's not as well. Here's, a, here's an example. There you go. So it's still his great op, but it's it's more old time. So um, it's less painty, more drawery. Um, so I'm gonna you know, hopefully I'm on the fence if I'm gonna crack it or not. Um, because I, I know some people when they crack it, they um, an inside page, a black page, gets some, some marking on it because it's so closed and when you open up it goes so um i'll tell you it again it goes so uh i'm on the fence but i want to read it so maybe i can uh i'm on the fence but i wanted to get it because it looks so cool it is all right let me see if i can put this in my catalog let's see what happens when i do this Help us with some detail. Ah, why do I have to help with some detail? I'm just going to clear for now. Ah, help us with some detail. No. I pay for you. You give me the detail. All right. Here we go. Since it's in the morning, I'm doing my coffee. All right. Clean that off. Okay. Alright, here we go. First one. Ooh. Hold on. Jump in the gun. <laughs> Once in Future, number 29. Can't believe I've been doing this for 29 issues. Still a great read. It's coming down to the bit. I think it's coming down to the end, though. Because, um... Ooh, I don't want to show you everything. But there, there's stuff going on here. Green Knight just got it. This art is awesome. I'm not. I don't, I'm, I'm not reading it. I haven't read anything. I know what's going on though, because I've been. I read the last issue. Um. So we're getting down to the one king. I think it's coming to the end. I don't know. I got a feeling it comes to the end. But it's Gillian does a great job writing. Moore does a great job drawing. Oh, uh, the ink is excellent. Number 29. Um, get the trade? You miss it out. Everybody knows about it, but get the trade. Um, when it's done, the trade's going to be, like, that big. Um, so we'll get the Omnibus? I, I don't know. Um, but um, you missed out. Great read. Great art. Great storytelling. It's got all that... King Arthur in there, and it's 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 great stuff. You missed out. You missed out. If this is towards the end. You're missing out. Um, if this becomes a jumping off point for another arc, get on it. If you can get the trades to catch up, get them. Get them. The camera's always up here, and I'm always looking down here. Get them. Um, I'm enjoying it. Oh, oh, oh. Okay.
Next one. After I put this in a bag. Put that into the reed pile. That Texas blood. Ugh. Gonna keep my hands off the table. 17. This is like third arc. Uh, which is cool. So I think it's every five. So this is uh, already two or three into the. Um, I'm not sure if it's every five or whatever, but it's just two or three into the into the start. This new arc. There's a killer on the loose. That's his face in the window. He's, I, that's her next. That's his next target. She works for this. I think since this is the past, this is his wife. Of this, of the, of the, um, I could be wrong, of the sheriff, sheriff. So if it is, well, she ain't gonna die. But if it isn't, well, maybe she's gonna die. So, anyways, um, but that's the kill on the loose. Condense in Phillips, great read. The art fits the story. Here's the sheriff right there. Um, here's the killer. He's in somebody's house. It looks like. Hear that he's not, he doesn't use his chairs at his house. I don't know, but um, I'm enjoying it. I enjoyed the, the first two arcs. I'm enjoying this one. It's a nice little, a nice little. I mean, it's a nice town, but I wouldn't want to live there because everybody keeps dying. But that's another story. Mm -hmm. A little postcard. All right, let's put this here. Let's just put this in over here. Look, I did that perfectly. Yes. Okay, Moon Knight. Number 15. All the three identities are coming together. Um, they had a little meeting. Oh, see, look. Boom, boom, and boom. So, um, they're coming together. They decided well back that they would step out and Mark would take over. We'll just do it. My Mark, Rack, and Jake. Mark. No. Mark, Grant, and Jake. Um... Hope I said that right. It's still early in the morning. Decided that it wasn't working, so they're gonna start working together. So that's how the last one ended. Not sure about this one. So, um, but it's, I'm still enjoying it. It's 15. Uh, great read. I always say that for great read. I'm a, I'm a drinking game. I am. Um, there's certain words I say all the time. Great read is one of them. I don't know if there's any miniseries, but this is the Moonlight. There's different stories, with it, which is cool. I mean, there'll be a different block. You know, three or four issues will be one story. Three or four issues will be the next. Story. This is Moonlighting, so. Um, it's 15. I don't know if there's any trades for this. You may be able to catch up if, you're, if, you, enjoy, if you like the, the, the character. I'm sure you're already, if it's, it's number 15, I'm sure you're already reading it. Um, but I'll enjoy it, and I'm showing you that I picked it up, right? All right. Punisher, number six. Again, it's not your normal Punisher book. And he's going after the, war, the God of War, the King of Killers. Book one, chapter six. Chapter six. There you go. The war of the god, the war of the gods of war. The war of the gods of war. Okay, I'll give it to you. But anyways, he's having some flashbacks. And now this is the actual fighting. The art is awesome. Really good art. I, I mean, I, it's probably all computer, but really good art. It's number six. Again, if you're looking for your basic Punisher book, it's not your pun basic Punisher book. It isn't. Um, but, uh, you know, like I said, it was. it's not my, it's not the, the Punisher I know, but I'm still reading it. I'm still enjoying it. Um, I, I think the last page shows that there's a character coming in. Oh, there you go. Number six, pick it up. It's a new look on, on Punisher. At least on my, at least the way I see it. Um, if you, I'm in reading it. I haven't dropped it yet. So 
<laughs> Does that really sound like I'm enjoying it? I haven't dropped it yet. Um, Clifford Wader. But um, um, I'm having a good time with it. I need to check something. If I get the right app. Yeah. Okay. Next one. Dark Knights, of, Dark Knights of Steel. But these are Tales of the Three Kingdoms. So it's an in-between. The story arc has... The story... The... The 12 issue hasn't finished yet so they stuck this in to make more money so it's it's all it's three or four little stories um, to give you more of an idea of the kingdoms I guess or, or the people in the store in the main 12 book issue uh, series that's why I picked it up I know I don't know I haven't read it I just stumped through it um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I'll let me know and I'll let you know. It's a one shot. Looks like a one shot deal. So I don't think it's really needed for the uh, the twelve issue series, but it's part of the twelve issue series. But I don't think you really need it to read it. Last but not least, Batman He's fighting um, failsafe. And I'm not going to even say, be able to say what his name is, but that Batman version popped out. So we'll see what happens. I'm not going to even try to what, read this guy's name. It sounds like some, it sounds like when he throws like stuff downstairs. Um, it's booked three of the um, Zadowski run. The art looks good. I like the art. I'm enjoying the art. But it's a, it's book three, that, so we'll see where it goes from here. But if he's fighting failsafe, which is a robot, I guess that he built um, to take care of Batman if he went rogue, I guess. Um, we'll see how it goes. Doo -doo -doo. And that's it, folks. That goes in my to read pile. That belongs in this pile. Damn, that's getting thick. Okay. Let me pop out of here because I didn't do this last time. Boop. There you go. I was almost going to cough. That's what I picked up this week. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you, hope you like some of the books I picked up. Um, read some of them if you haven't read them. Now, I know I'm going to be doing a, um, a sipping on the 16th, and we're doing the um, Hot Wing Challenge the second week in November. So make sure you guys uh, put those on your calendar. Uh, also, I'm planning to do, I th think I've narrowed it down to an, um, December, the first weekend in December. And I still got to start reaching out to people in the community. Uh, I'm going to try to do a 24-hour show um, for a uh, cause, uh, DIGP, I think it is, a DIPG, TIPG, I think it is. Um, sorry, it's been two. It's it's a bunch of letters together, and I'm a little tired. Um, it's a brain cancer in children, and I know a family, and a, a, their daughter died from it a few years ago. Close family, love that kid. Um, Selena, this is for you. Um, so I'm going to be doing, I'm going to try to get that together for the first week in December, 24 hours. So, um, more to come on that. And, but again, we're doing the third annual, um, Hot Wing Challenge in early November. Um, I already got the thumbnail out there and I'm going to be doing a, uh, sipping, you know, late night sipping 
Um, the 16th, I think it is. Um, I think it's the 16th. Can I get a calendar here, folks? Yes, the 16th. So, um, be ready for that. And also, I know in the near future, I got to pick up a book. And I'll be doing a uh, another one of those uh, bedtime stories with Old Wolf. Um, so keep an eye out for that too. <laughs> All right, you guys. See you guys later. Uh, thanks for watching. Enjoy your day. Remember, this comes out at seven o'clock. See ya.